Hey guys, it's Pugnacious Perugly here. Welcome back to some more Pokemon Reborn with Sean. Last time, we uh, cleaned up some side quests, and we took a train to Tourmaline Desert. And now I'm lost. <laughs> oh, here we go. Wait, dude, I was gonna say, when in doubt, bust out the item finder. Did I say level 69 to Marowak? I do like Marowak, but... I feel like it's this one and this Pokemon, they're gonna be hard to fit in like for us to really add a team member at this point i feel like it has to be like a really multi-layered pokemon crocodile you know speaking of which um that water type that we were wanting to add to our team like 100 episodes ago i think that's supposed to be available now really after the 14th gym also i'm sorry but i can't stop noticing how crocodile's nose looks like a you know what are you saying you're staring at Crocodile's nose? Uh, no, well, I'm not now. <laughs> but that water type, uh, is it in the desert? I actually have no idea where it is. <laughs> so uh, maybe we'll get to the next city or, or the next Pokemon Center and we'll save. Or we'll, we'll get that as like a flyaway point and then we'll check it out. Yeah. Oh yeah, item finder. We should put that on for sure. I reminded you. No, I'm kidding. Okay, we have some direction here. A wall. <laughs> a boundary. A Mandy Buzz. Pretty bulky. Oh, okay, bye. Oh, okay, we're still here. What the fuck? I guess we'll keep her we'll keep her pelts off for a little bit just to see what the encounters are. Yeah. Might Mandy come in handy for the next gym. Mandy Buzz is like actually kinda useful. Yeah, I remember using Mandy Buzz in like maybe it was like Gen 6 OU. Definitely a popular choice back then. With like foul play and stuff. Yeah. Damn, we have a lot of milk. Yeah, I stocked up. We are milkmen, if you would. Oh, okay. This tower is not important, I guess. How come a focus ash? Yeah, that's useful, but it is consumable, which is kind of annoying. I agree. So some parts of the desert, you like slow down when you're running. Yeah, I was gonna ask you about that. Like, what is the consistency to that? I'm not sure. We should have gotten, like, that bike-looking thing from XD that, like, we can fly over the desert with. <laughs> like that, that hover scooter? Yeah. Also, Heliois. Like, die. Nobody likes you. Heliolisk. I used it once in, uh, in Gen 6. Underwhelming. Yeah, he's not. I mean, he's a normal electric type, which is kind of neat, I guess, but... I don't know. I have a hard time viewing normal as, like, an asset. It gives you some good stab. It does. That's true. Cacturn, though. Run away. <laughs> Bro doesn't like grass types. You're right. Fuck a wild cacturn. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I like Cacturn. Cacturn is cool. Not particularly good, especially like against some of the shit we'd be going up against now, but. Cacturn is a Pokemon that really could use like a Mega Form in Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. Honestly. He just needs something. Like the potential is there. It's just. He just fell off as the generations went on. Yeah. I think Grass Dark has quite a few weaknesses too. True. Yeah, because I don't think Grass Dark, it that doesn't help to cancel out any of its weaknesses. It just adds more. That's right. A lot of cacti suddenly. Mm-hmm. Well, I wonder if this is the same field effect that we got from, um, like, kind of recently from the school, you know, the one that Florinia used? Could be. Oh, an oasis. 
Relic Copper? I think you sell that for money. Oh, there's a healing thing here. Random. What the? Wow. Uh. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just upset. <laughs> wait, so, wait, so did that not heal us? No, it did. No, it huh. did. Weird. I wonder if there's something coming up. Usually those are around when we're about to get into some some mischief. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, here we go. This is easier to walk on. Oh, no, never mind. I guess what you're supposed to do is, like, follow the railroad tracks, but of course my first instinct was to just wander around aimlessly. Yeah. This place is huge, though. So, Sean, have you gotten a chance to use Sora on new uh, in Smash? I have not. I haven't gotten him or Kazuya yet. Mm -hmm. I need to do seems that. Like, seems like an interesting character. Yeah, he's very floaty. He... For a while, I was doing the challenge where I would beat like classic mode in Smash Ultimate with like not the hardest difficulty, but like essentially with the highest score where like you end on 9.9 .9 or whatever right yeah i was doing that for a while and i was keeping it up with the dlc characters but then i stopped after like sephiroth i mean there's not that many characters in between sephiroth and now there's like what maybe six seven i think just two. Oh, just two. Oh, I, I wow, sephiroth. oh yeah that sephiroth was this year huh yeah i think pyra and mithra may have come after him though so maybe it was three after all hmm All right, Sean, I think we've seen what there is to see in this desert. Yeah, I was just thinking the same thing. Crocodile, Mandibuzz, Cacti, Marowak. Cacti. <laughs> Maractus needed to be tied into Cacturn somehow with be with a better beast stat total. That could have been nice. But then... Under but, 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 but that Gen 5 wouldn't have been, like, completely separate from, uh... No, I, I I understand that part, but in the grand scheme of things, like probably would have been better off. At least in my opinion. Is this Oasis also going to disappear? I mean, depends. Is there a healing spot? Oh, there is. An ability capsule. I mean, there's a guy there we can talk to. Yeah, I'm kind of afraid to, though. What if he activates, like, the Oasis disappearing? You could always save. Ah. Oh. Oh! Have you come here seeking out a badge, too? Whoa. Banger? I'm jamming. This is a new song. Let's see, I think he's... Grass Ghost. This is a brand new song. It's cool, though. No, nah, it's a banger. I guess this is for, like, Ace Trainers. Uh, have we fought it? I feel like have, well, okay, I really don't know. Have we fought an Ace Trainer before? I don't know. That is a Ghost-type Marowak. Okay, shoot. Try that. Ghost Fire, right? Yeah. Yeah. Can you miss me with that Flare Blitz? Mm, nope. At least we can still redeem the XP. He didn't kill- Oh, well, yeah, okay. <laughs> Wait, no, he's gonna die! No! <laughs> no XP for us. Fucking whack. Oh, shoot. Uh... Wait, is what's Greninja's typing? It's water dark, but then he's gonna have protein and change his type and ruin everything, so... Uh, yeah, yeah exactly. Right. Yeah. 
Just the desert the soften the attack. Protein is lame, dude. We're not living another uh, surf, by the way. Oh, this is um a remix of um Team Skull's theme. Seriously. <laughs> you know we've grown up when certain themes don't hold the same weight. Like if like I feel like if this was a more retro thing, we would have picked it up immediately. But Oh yeah. <laughs> The fact it took you that long to realize that. <laughs> Very true. Like if it was, let's see. <laughs> yeah, I guess like Team Magma, Team Aqua. Team Magma, Team Aqua, even something from Coliseum or uh, XD. Yeah. Weavile. Weavile has been fucking me up in our Gen 4 OU League. <laughs> We bought a good mon, dude, in Gen 4. A really good mon. It's just fast and hits hella hard. Yeah. People run it either choice or with Focus Sash, and like if you can't figure out which one it is immediately, you can screw yourself. Yeah. Honestly, we Weavile is like has no business being as good as I feel like there's a lot of Pokemon in Gen 4 that are like better than they should be. But because of the limitations of like that meta, it's just yeah, you just kind of have to deal with it. They all disappeared. The Ace Trainer included. <laughs> yeah, they, he's just gone now. Was he real? The world may never know. Man, I could use like a map or something. Some kind of direction. There we go. Well, isn't it kind of weird that the train stop goes into the desert? <laughs> yeah. I think there's supposed to be like a city up here or something. Oh, this is kind of random, but there's um, there's like a drawn artwork of the Reborn map that you can find on like the reborn website and it's really cool looking i want to show it to you later okay well there's it's, something right there yeah it's, this looks promising <laughs> it's, it's huge the big sand hole it's huge huge sugaling cave sugaling cave suggling sugaling that is a that looks like some quicksand over there Game over, I don't know. <laughs> Not another one? Whoa, how deep does this go? What the hell? Oh. Oh. Weird. It Which cycles way? us back. What happens if we, like, go down? And then take the ladder, right? Yeah. What the fuck is this? We're not even like by the entrance anymore. I have no idea where we are. I don't like how confusing this is about to get. I mean, think about like the past routes in this game. First of all, that's a level 87 Maractus. It is. But yeah, like route one was enormous, route two was enormous. Yeah. I guess this isn't really a route, but still. There's a pot over there. With a great ball.
I guess we'll just try going down a hole. There's a ladder up there. Kind of weird. Yeah, there's probably a loop around. Or maybe not. Oh uh, yeah, we're kind of stuck uh, here. I mean, there's quicksand right there, but... Everyone knows if you see a, a, a quicksand hole, you should jump right in there. That's how you progress. I guess we don't know what the encounters are in here yet, but... Wait, we encountered a Miraculous, did we not? Oh, that's true. A very high-level one. Yeah. And a very high-level Drapion. Drapion? It's fucking... I'm gonna let you go. Yeah. So I think the next gym leader is Titania, just based on, like, context clues and stuff. I can see it. So that'll be a steel type gym leader. A steel type gym leader with Aegis Slash, specifically. Oh god. So that'll be fun. Now I remember what she was doing in that uh water restoration area. Yeah. Just <laughs> killing people with her Aegis Slash. Honestly. This place is enormous. And there's no one here. <laughs> I think that's the uh, more offsetting part is that there's no one really here. There's illusions and oasises. Here we go. Magical seed. I feel like we've been here before, yeah. No, we have. Man, I don't know how I'm going to remember where all these quicksand holes take us. I feel like we're going to end up going through them so many times, you're just going to catch on. Pop rocks. This is a remix of the Game Corner. Mm. I think so, yeah. Right, so we came up here before, but couldn't find anything. Okay, so that just leads back down here. Okay, I'm just starting to get a little bit of a sense of what's going on here. Mm. Try this one? I think we've been done this one too. I believe yeah, that so. that takes us back here, okay. Yeah. Different direction this time. We were up there before. Try that one over there. A level 81 Boldor. <laughs> sure. Because <laughs> why not? <laughs> uh, hold on, dude. Can we uh yep. pause for really quick? Okay, so Slushy stepped away for a second, and I was just looking for some hidden items on this platform. I found, like, three. Ooh, nice. Anything of, uh, nope? Not really. Pekka Berry? <laughs> it's a little too late in the game for that to be a big deal. Yeah, it might be time to switch to a higher level elite Pokemon here. I guess it's nice, because, like, we're seeing what the encounters are without, like, being bombarded. Yeah, I think we lead with Whack, man. Old Reliable. Old Reliable. He's been with us for... What episode is this? Who even knows anymore? Um, <laughs> Like 170, I think. God damn. We've been at this for a minute. I wonder if, like... So I, I, I kept in the bit in that one episode where I was saying I thought it was really funny that we just spent six episodes looking for volunteers and, like, doing side quests. I wonder if... Other people are annoyed by this, or if they're just on board with the fact that this LP just keeps going forever? Uh, probably a combination of both. I mean, I would imagine that it's more content 
So if that, they're a fan of the true. actual channel, then it shouldn't really matter. Like originally when I said I want to see everything this game has to offer, I had no idea. <laughs> what you were in for this game is enormous yeah that's why i think it i mean that's part of the reason why i think it's so interesting yeah no doubt there's a lot of layers to it too for sure oh yeah so there was like a notification or i guess maybe like an update on like the final uh version of the game where they're gonna add the post game i think mm. and uh i think they're what? wanting to release it in like spring 2022 interesting so that might be so, around the time we reach that point of the game anyway. Right. I mean, I, I, I would imagine we can wrap this up before then. It's, it's four gym badges. Yeah, but you figure, like, these are now, like, the later updates of the game. And, like, I I seem to recall between, like, episode 15 and 18, those episodes took a long time to cut up to come out. True. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to do that. What? Did you not do that on purpose? No. Oh shit. <laughs> well, now we're back to this freaking square one. Let's see. Okay, this is good. This is where we were. Then we went up here. Okay, we're back. Uh, so there's four, five holes here. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. What the fuck? Eleven, twelve. 13, 14. Why wow, there's gotta be so many? <laughs> okay, well, I don't. Am I supposed to choose which one is the correct one? Because I have no idea. God, Sean. <laughs> I, am I supposed to check every hole in that room? Because there's a lot of them. <laughs> I mean, I guess. Sean, I feel like we haven't actually accomplished anything in this episode. We haven't, but we've been going for a while. It's funny how that works. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that would get boosted more by the sandstorm. I mean, it still did a good chunk. Uh, yeah. Oh, that could not be good. Yeah, let's see what our damage roll looks like. We're fine. Okay, we're fine. Yeah, we're fine. As long as he doesn't use the next turn, but I don't know if you're allowed to do that two turns in a row. Okay, good. I don't think you are. Silly cacturn, tricks are for kids. You idiot. <laughs> Try a couple more of these holes. Pause. <laughs> no, wait, no, no, Sean. I think you took it the wrong way. <laughs> when, when I said when I said pause, it's like it's like wait, wait a second. W what do you mean by that? Well, hold on. <laughs> like that, like that could be kind of X-rated, but never mind. I want to. Fuck. You want to what? Uh, examine more of the holes. Okay, alright. Investigate. Okay. See what's going on. Okay, alright. Yeah? You wanna tell me more? No, that's it. <laughs> okay. I, don't, I mean, I, I, don't, I don't know what you're getting at. Okay. I think you do. The people watching this episode who are familiar with her porn, they're like, ah, uh, yes. The room with no. all the holes. Mm, yes, quite. I should probably be doing this in like a more scientific way because like I have not been tracking which <laughs> Neither have I. I'm just I'm just I'm just hoping some shit pops off. I'm not even gonna lie to you. <laughs> that's how that's how it is when you're born. I'm just hoping some shit finally pops off. Let's try going I don't think I tried going down this hole yet. Okay. I think there's like two layers. And if you fall down a hole, that's like, oh, well, no. 
crafty. He's too what shy. in tarnation? Ouch. Jerk. That shit was not cool at all. I like how even with the even with the rappel on, we're like finding plenty of encounters. Yeah, dude, it's getting to that point in the game. Maybe they're uh they're trying to get us to level up more. Nah, we're fine. Although Dynablade probably is We're gonna have to make a decision soon if we're gonna keep uh keep Dynablade in the rotation. Well, thinking about the remaining gems, it's like, oh this is new, maybe. We have steel, water, dragon, like, and rock. So I think between those, it's like, Don't kind really of blade, need not immediately useful in any of those. Yeah. I guess I'll start killing things because I want to level up so we don't encounter more, <laughs> more shit. Also, Chaos Tar in particular will be good against the steel type gym leader, I think, so. Agreed. There we go. So this is a new room right here, also with many holes. Try Have you ever seen one. the movie holes? Um, yes. It's been a while though. I feel like it's. I feel like the movie is like a fever dream of my childhood. <laughs> Where it was just it came on a Disney Channel and you would like watch it. Yeah. And then not remember much. For me, that movie's Parent Trap. The Parent Trap is a weird one, because it feels so... I don't know. Maybe it's because I saw it at a really young age. And I guess you're a lot more impressionable, but that movie just has a weird spot in my mind. <laughs> for me, for some reason, I remember that movie, like, being really long. That was my yeah. impression of it when I was younger. Like, wow, this movie just keeps going. I think it's like a two. Oh, that's 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 a good uh, that's a good point. It's like two hours, which for that kind of movie is pretty fucking long. I'll be honest. Yeah. Uh, it also came out a couple of months after I was born. Uh, uh -huh. I wonder if I wonder if I'm thinking of the right Parent Trap because I think there's like two different Parent Traps. There's an original and a remake. So you're probably thinking of the one with the uh, the twins. Yeah. Uh, so the, mar the the movie is two hours and eight minutes long, so you are right, it is pretty long. Especially with commercial breaks. Oh yeah. Turned into like a fucking three, uh, two and a half hour, almost three hour sit-in. Oh, here we go, ladder. Oh shit. There's a button below the statue of Arceus. Press it. But nothing happened. But nothing happened? The button is shoved firmly into the statue already. Oh, there's probably another button on, like, the other side of this, like, gate. Yeah. Okay. And probably, uh, probably another set of holes we have to go through, and then to find another ladder to get to the other side. Yeah, we've done this one already. I think we may have tried all these already. Yeah. You know, I wonder if this is not the Game Corner theme and it's actually Professor Sycamore's theme. I can never remember. <laughs> I can't remember either. Durant is kind of threatening. He's a mean boy. Also, he didn't die. Yeah, he's steel bug. Imagine that guillotine hit it or hit. I said hit it. I would not have been happy. Neither would I. We get it, Chaos Heart, you're ripped. Okay, there we go. <laughs> and as far as this episode goes, like I'm I'm willing to keep just keep going until we like maybe find the next button or whatever. We'll give it a uh, a bit more. Yeah. We didn't do much last time, so 
Maybe just try well, like this. Maybe that's not true. Maybe well, that's not true. We, we, uh, we, we tied up some loose ends. I guess that's true with side quests. Yeah. So glad we're done with that fucking job applications quest now. Yeah, that was pretty fucking dumb. It's funny because like even now there's still like a ton more stuff we can do. Yeah. Oh well. Let's see, is there a ladder? Oh. Oh. Oh, what the? Okay, so this leads here. So I think we'll eventually progress here, but yeah. We Wait, can't why can't we go up that? It's like slippery. Oh, that's a, oh, it's oh, I see. Sean, we have a very finite amount of close combats. Oh, so it's only five. Pretty sure. I'm, I'm worried that Bulldoze won't kill anymore. Wow. This fucking guy. Let me just be the most annoying random encounter <laughs> in history. He's, he's not even doing shit, he's just being annoying. Okay, so we should remember this for later, because eventually we'll have to come back here. Correct. I guess I should make it extra sure there's like nothing here that's important. When repels stop working. The nightmare scenario. You know, you know what might be good in here is uh, Choice Specs Brode with Surf. Oh, that, that's not a bad idea at all. I don't think about it. Our Surf will get weakened by the, the sand, but I'm desperate. Yeah. Motherfucker. There we go. All right, so we'll note that in the back of our heads. Yeah, that's important. These encounters are starting to get nuts. I wonder if I'll do more edits where I put dumb images over the Pokemon. That'd be pretty funny. <laughs> you have the most wild edits, like shit that's just like random. Did you see I put different sound effects over like all the volunteers we got. Did you really? Yeah. I'm gonna just go look at that after this. I kept a counter on screen of all the volunteers we got, and for each one I had like a different, not every single one, but for a lot of them I had different sound effects. Remember the time you fucking changed the sound effects for the Pokemon that popped up just to troll me? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. That's, that was nuts. <laughs> <laughs> fucking the hot dog theme for uh for uh Trixie are you serious that was a throwback to like no I know what it yeah, was a yeah, throwback yeah. to I'm telling the viewers like that was like uh -oh. a, 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 that was like a, an in joke with us like years and years ago fucking hot dog hot dog hot diggity dog yo that's crazy <laughs> why there's so many strong bulldoors in here All right, choice Bex Broder it is. Shit. He has sludge away for cactus too, or for, for cactus, just <laughs> non-specific cactus. <laughs> I mean, there's two of them, so. We can run choice Bex Carla now, potentially. That could be strong. Problem is that she's slow. Yeah. You figure like, a, oh, I guess Mega Amphros can't run choice Bex. Never mind. That would be dope. Also, we still... I don't think we've ever gotten, like, the Mega Ring anyway, so, like... No, we still don't have that. Yeah, like no hints or anything, huh? <laughs> mm -hmm. Try like the bottom most one. I don't think we tried this one yet. Ugh. Oh, maybe we could save and like do it that way. 
I mean, we could. That'd be way faster, sure. right? I don't. I, I'm not convinced that saving us a whole lot of time. We still got to go through the loading screen and all that. I bet it's faster. Shell smash? Are you serious? Get him out. He really wants all right, the power. All right, all right, now you're just doing the most. I think we could also turn off animations now. It's probably not a bad idea. That'll save time too. Yeah. I'll take the level though. What if this is actually like a training arc and we just haven't realized yet? Probably is. Okay, and then we're gonna go up here, and then the hole we've been using is the one all the way up here. There's probably like secret stuff in these other holes, but like, I don't know. Let's see how much this does. Oh, you know who'd be good here is potentially Arcanine with Flamethrower. In close no combat. doubt. Yeah, well, it probably would be. Super effective against a wide range of stuff. Goostigum could have been okay too, but I don't know if we have him right now. So you said you're going to save? Yeah, so I'm going to come down here. I'm going to save. Then we'll just try like... I guess all the holes. I, I, because so far I actually remember which ones we've we've used so far. Okay. All right. Yes, yeah, that's pretty fast. Oh yeah, I guess you're right. He more looks like an incomplete Pokemon. An incomplete Pokemon. It's my opinion. He looks unfinished. It looks like like the rest of his body is like designed like completely but then his head is like really simple looking yeah earthworm gym looking <laughs> <laughs> okay well i'm going insane um we tried every hole in that room and even though i'm pretty sure one of them gave us progress earlier like i can't oh yeah that's right we use a ladder not any of the holes Okay. And there's nothing else to do there. So now we know all of these holes, literally every single one, lead back to the starting area. Yeah, I guess that's good to know. <laughs> In that room specifically. Yeah. Alright, let's call it here. Next time on Pokemon Reborn. More wandering aimlessly in the Sugilene Cave. <laughs>